Hey, good afternoon. It's Jeremiah with Affordable Mobility Solutions, and today I'm shooting a video of our 2017 Dodge Grand Caravan. You can see with either key fob here, I can operate both power sliding doors. It's got the needle, needle is working, it's got the brown ability, power conversion comes out the side, 29 and a half inch wide ramp. We've got 52 inches of headroom coming inside the van. Then we got about 57 inches of room once you're inside the van. We've got this hard plastic floor, easy to clean if it gets dirty. We've got the rear seats back there, they're very very clean the upgraded q strength tie downs those are high dollar you know we throw those in at no additional charge to you a lot of our competitors are going to charge you six to eight hundred dollars to upgrade to those so make sure you're comparing apples to apples we have removable front seats so if you wanted to remove the passenger seat for example and put a wheelchair up there you'd have room for a second wheelchair in the back you could remove the uh, passenger seat park your wheelchair here transfer over to the driver's seat if you wanted to uh, we could even put an easy lock in we could pull that seat out Put an easy lock in, you can snap your wheelchair in and drive from your wheelchair. Allows a lot of versatility. You know, let us know your measurements. Let us know what you're trying to use the van for. Let us help customize this van to meet your needs. It has the rear air controls, headliners in great shape. It's got your uh, kneeling system, which I have turned on there. It's got your cup holders, plugs for your electronics. You can operate the conversion right here as well. Dual climate control, rear air, backup camera. You can sync up your phone there to keep your eyes on the road. Dash is in great shape, no cracks or holes in the dash. And you can do all the uh, power doors up here as well. So when you have everybody secure, oh, one other thing I like about these rear entries is they have not only room in the back for you know storage, groceries, anything like that. But if you are taking a long trip, you want some extra room, all you have to do is pull here, and the seat will fold down. Extra room for luggage, groceries can have it done in a matter of seconds. As I exit the van, I'm going to shut it because I'm out here. Hit that button twice, it'll come right back up. The knee will come up. It's got tinted windows in the rear. The tires are almost all darn near brand new. You've got about nine, 30 seconds of tread left on them. So not quite brand new, but they're in very good shape. And you hear me talk all the time, how we can save you five to $10,000 on your next wheelchair accessible van. How we do it is simple, it's low overhead. We have one central location right here in the middle of the country, Wichita, Kansas. That allows us to do free shipping anywhere in the lower 48 states saves you money a little scuff right there in the paint so if I see it I'm gonna show it to you but uh, with our one location like I said free shipping saves you money uh, the other thing is with our one location I want you to imagine our competitors with 5 10 20 or more locations imagine how many thousands if not millions of dollars per month they have an overhead that we don't have that's how we save you so much money on your next wheelchair accessible van and no matter who you do business with Get a video of the VIN number on the van. Why say that? Uh, Facebook Marketplace, for example, the dirtiest place in the world to buy a vehicle. They're taking pictures of our vans. They're cutting out my signs up here. They'll post this van on the internet for $15,000 with a $1,000 deposit to hold it. They're trying to get someone to send them $1,000 trying to scam you. So get a, tell them I want a video of the VIN number. My name is Jeremiah Coleman. I own Affordable Mobility Solutions, and I have this van here in my possession. They couldn't make that video because they don't have these vans. They're simply stealing pictures and trying to scam people. Get you that video, protect yourself. Also, what we do with that VIN number, run a Carfax on every single one of our vehicles before we buy it. Shows five owners here. It's got some damage reported previously. I'll show that to you as we scroll down here. Carfax shows no, no salvage, junk, rebuilt, fire, flood, hail, or lemon brands on the title. So this is not one of the super risky salvage or rebuilt titles. This is a clean title. Uh, shows no total loss as well. Carfax shows there's never been structural damage Airbags have never been deployed. Odometer's accurate. They'll show a slew of a uh, little damage. I think the person that had this prior probably was not the best driver in the whole world. Bumped into a few things, but like I said, Carfax shows there's never been airbags have never deployed, never been structural damage. So I'm not afraid to buy a seven, eight year old vehicle that's had some paint work done, had a door painted, had a bumper painted, everything looks good. Again, no structural damage. Airbags have never gone off. And no matter who you do business with, find them online, check out their ratings and reviews. Find us on eBay, 1,580 transactions. Every single one of those transactions left us positive feedback, 100%. I'd say that's a good reputation. And no matter who you do business with, find them on Google. Make sure they are a real company. Make sure they have a handful of reviews. Check out our 4.8 out of 5 stars with 326 Google reviews. I hear horror stories all the time about people uh, buying from the general public or a low-end dealer, you know, 1 and 2 and 3 star reviews. And instead of the 5, 4.8 like we have, they end up buying a van that's got a salvage title they weren't told about, flood damage they weren't made aware of, you know, major mechanical issues, engine, transmission, electrical, you name it, I've heard it all. So hey, if you want the one and two and three star experience, 
you go ahead and roll your dice with the general public and the low end dealers. If you want five star vans with five star service with the best prices in the country, I look forward to working with you. Okay, back to the van, like I mentioned, we do have the two keys here. As I open the door, it's got these light colored cloth seats, it's got the power driver seat, I'm showing you right now, it works great. A little bit of wear on this armrest. These color armrests are hard to find because they are very rare. So just heads up, again, I'm shooting you straight. But overall, the interior is in excellent condition. I know you've already seen back here. And when I go to start up the van, you can see 69,983 miles. Fires right up, all the dummy lights work and they all go out. So there's no check engine lights on, no airbag lights, no ABS, none of that. It's got the backup camera. That's a real nice safety feature to have. I'll show you that radio works there. and I. I've got three different mechanics that work for me. We inspect these vans very thorough. We check all the power mirrors and windows. I'm going to show you the mirrors and windows working right now. Power locks, heat, air, cruise, belts, hose of suspension, steering, brakes. Taking this vehicle is not a road test. My point is we do not just run these through the car wash and put them on the lot. They go through a very thorough inspection before they hit my lot. Underneath the hood we have a 3.6 V6 engine. Idles smoothly. No signs of any damage. No signs of any leaks. And it purrs like a kitten. As I crawl underneath the van, much of the same. No signs of any bent metal from an accident. No signs of any oil or fluid leaks. Uh, no signs of any water damage from being in a flood. And no signs of any rust from being up north. That's the number one mistake people make when they buy used vehicles. They assume things. They assume just because it looks good in pictures. They assume it runs and drives good. They assume it's never been in a bad accident or a flood, for example. And that is the most dangerous thing you can do. So what I want you to do, I want you to go check out my competition. I don't care if it's another dealer. I don't care if it's a private individual. But I want you to ask yourself, do they show me their reputation online so I know I'm dealing with someone honest, reputable, and fair? Do they show me a free Carfax report so I can see the vehicle's got a clean title, no major accidents, never been in a flood? Do they get out on their hands and knees and even bother taking a couple pictures of the undercarriage, much less a detailed video so you can see no flood damage, no signs of a major accident? Do they get up on the roof and check out, uh, show you the roof, show you there's no holes drilled in, drilled in for me in a taxi, no hell damage up there. You know how many vehicles I see at auction every week where the roof is just trash, but the sellers don't fix the roof because no one looks at the roof. Jeremiah with affordable mobility, he looks at the roof. You should too. So when it comes to uh, price, reputation, and how thorough they are showing you the exact vehicle you're getting, please compare me to the competition. And tell me what ends up happening. If you buy a van you can't get a title for it because you're dealing with deal with a shady individual or you've got a vehicle that's got a, tight, a bad frame from an accident or a flood. In both those cases and in many more, if that happens, if you can't register it, you can't drive it, you just bought a 4,000 pound paperweight. So to avoid these problems and so many more, do four things before you buy from anybody. Demand a detailed video like this. Not some lazy 30 second walk around, folks. You're not buying a pair of shoes off eBay. This is a major purchase. Demand a detailed video. Second. Demand a Carfax report. Yes, Carfax costs me thousands of dollars a month, but I do a Carfax on every single vehicle before I buy it. You should too. A third, get online, find out who you're buying from, check out their reputation and reviews. Lazy buyers get scammed. Don't be a lazy buyer. Do your due diligence and then finally demand a warranty. Our van comes with a 90 day, 3,000 mile, drivetrain plus warranty. Go to any shop in the country. Do not risk buying as is. Demand that warranty. Okay, the final portion of the video, I always like to get the vans out on the highway, give them some gas so you can hear the engine run, feel the transmission shift through all the gears, and you know whether you take advantage of our free shipping in the lower 48 states, or if you come in and drive this caravan home. We've done our due diligence, made sure it's roadworthy, pop it up to 60 miles an hour. If I can get up to 70 with some traffic, I sure will. You can see the steering wheel is nice and straight, no unusual vibration or noise. This van runs and drives very nice down the highway. There we go, little runway here up to 70 miles an hour in the blink of an eye not a race car but it definitely does what it's supposed to do so do keep in mind we offer a complimentary 90-day warranty at no additional charge to you we do have long-term warranties that cover uh, more components on the van including the conversion the conversions can be kind of costly to work on if they go bad so talk to me about how you can affordably protect your investment long term also keep in mind we don't have any hidden fees a lot of these dealers have a real nice price online but they have hidden in the fine prints, $500 administrative fee, they've got document fees, they've got tag fees, they've got freight, you name it, they have a fee for it. You know what they don't have? Free shipping. So by the time you add up all the hidden fees, by the time you add up the cost of shipping, that real nice price you saw online just jumps three or $4,000. Not 
such a nice price anymore, is it? So be sure to ask about shipping and fees before you buy or sit back, relax. Let me take care of all that for you at no additional charge to you. My question to you, if someone's not telling you the real price of a vehicle, if they have a bunch of hidden fees on the back end to try and make more money out of you, what else are they hiding from you? Is it a salvage title? Is it flood damage? Is it major mechanical issues? You know, I can't speak for them, but one thing I can speak for, that in any business, and none more important than the used car business, transparency is key. That's exactly why I'm out here making this video today, to be 100% transparent with you. Keep that in mind when you're out vehicle shopping. I'm going to give the van a nice hard break at the bottom of this ramp. You'll see no grinding, no squeaking, no unusual brake noise or vibration, all exactly what we're looking for. By the way, it's about 100 degrees here today. I actually had to turn the air conditioner down. I was getting a little cold. I've got the middle setting now. AC works great. And if you'd like to call or text us, preferably text, that way anyone in our office can respond ASAP. Text is the best way to get a hold of us, but 316-262-VANS. That's 316-262-8267. My name is Jeremiah. I am the owner. That is direct line to call or text me. I challenge you to ask the competition if they are dedicated enough to customer service to give you a direct line to call or text the owner. Or do you get to call in, talk to an automated system, end up in somebody's voicemail and never get a call back? Or maybe you do get that live person as that super aggressive, pushy, used car salesman who's going to call you five times a day to ask you if you're ready to make a deal. So if you're like me, sick of being treated like just a number by all these companies out there, and you definitely want to avoid that annoying used car salesman, Give us a call, give us a text, we'll walk you through start to finish, and I promise you, I'm going to sell this caravan, whether you buy it or not, absolutely zero pressure sales here. Uh, yes, we do have financing available. We can send an application to your phone or email address. If computers aren't your thing, get in touch with us. We'll give you a call, we'll take an application over the phone, no problem. Uh, yes, we do take trade-ins, even from across the country, whether standard or mobility vehicle, get in touch with us, I can explain how that works. And if you've made it to the end of our video, thanks for hanging in there. I know it's a long video, but I also try to be as thorough as I possibly can because, again, I know this is a major purchase. And if you ever do want to come in to visit us, we welcome that, but we do require that you make an appointment. We have three different locations. Help us get the van or vans you're looking at the proper location for you. Save yourself and us some time. Make that appointment. And if you'd like to see our entire inventory with detailed videos just like this, free shipping, free car facts reports, and dozens of pictures of every vehicle so you know exactly what you're getting from the most thorough and transparent mobility dealership in the entire country. Check out our website 24 hours a day at www.mobility316.com. That's mobility316.com. And as always, thank you so much for checking us out at Mobility 316, home of affordable mobility solutions where mobility is affordable. Give us that call or text today, and I hope you have yourself a wonderful day.